Are you looking for the best emergency radios in your budget? Well in today's video, we break down the top 5 best emergency radios that are available on the market. I made this list based on my personal opinion and I tried to list them based on their price quality, durability, and more to see the more information about these product. I found these products much helpful for people like you. You can check out the description below also make sure you subscribe for more videos. Okay so let's get started with the video. Number 5. Running Snail MD-090 Weather Radio. Right out of the box this radio seemed well designed. It is pretty durable and for the size, you can't beat the features that come with it. There are a lot of features crammed into a unit of this size. I can fit this into the front pocket of my jeans. Yes, it is uncomfortable, but it can be done. The LED light on the front is a decent size and puts out enough light to be useful for navigating in the dark. It is also nice to have the reading lamp which can light a small room. The hand crank on the back is well concealed and feels pretty sturdy. I also like how the shallow angle allows for easy turning without it wanting to fold in on itself. I know this seems a little nitpicky but when you are winding this thing for several hours, it starts to drive you insane. Number 4. Kaito KA500. The KA500 is on the larger side of most weather radios but you get a few extra features compared to the smaller radios. It also feels pretty durable so you know it won't break the first time you use it. This radio comes with a headphone jack which helps save power. You also get a standard AC-DC 6V input port on top of the USB 5V input port. On top of having a Li-ion battery, it has receptacles for 3 AA batteries. I really like products that fill multiple purposes. The KA500 is one of those products. The running snail MD-090 above was the best for survival slash outdoor use, but the KA500 can do both survival slash outdoor as well as indoors. The fact that it has a no alert setting really sets this radio up to be something that is used on a daily basis. The alert setting allows the radio to monitor the weather band without making any noise. When it receives a weather alert, it kicks itself on and broadcasts the special weather information. Number 3. POVO PA R01. I like the SOS alarm on this radio. I know that sounds silly, but this thing is loud, and if you are trapped under a house after a tornado or hurricane, it is sure to reach someone's ear. It has an LED flashlight that has different brightness levels as well as having a blink function. Remember before when I complained about how hard it was to tune one of the radios? Well, this one is completely different. The tune knob is silky smooth and allows for you to finely adjust the frequency so you can get the most solid signal. This radio also has a headphone jack which is great for saving the battery since it doesn't have to use the larger speaker. And while I'm on the topic of listening, you can use a USB or micro SD card to listen to MP3s, really this is the last thing you should be thinking of when trying to conserve power, but if you have a ton of AAA batteries, then switch the power source off the lithium battery and jam out. Number 2. Eaton FRX3 Plus. Overall this is the highest quality radio on the list. It feels solid and looks good. And you just can't beat the backlit LCD screen. It is also very smooth and simple to tune. The crank arm is positioned front and center and is very easy to turn. It has a flashlight on the front which isn't the greatest but certainly not the worst. This radio is perfect as a bedside radio. It has an alarm function as well as a weather alert function. This radio gets the best reception out of all the radios on the list. And that goes for all the bands. AM, FM, and the preset weather band all sound great. And you have two headphone jacks in the back. The manual that comes with it is very helpful. It just seems like someone really tried with this one. Number 1. Baofeng BFF8 HP Ham Radio. Just a quick disclaimer, this radio isn't considered a weather radio but it gives us a good comparison between two types of radios. In this case, a ham radio and a weather radio. This radio is considered to be one of the best two-way radios on the market. On top of being able to tune FM and NOAA stations, you have the ability to tune VHF and UHF frequencies as well. Being able to transmit on many different bands during a survival scenario could get you rescued very quickly. 
If your life isn't on the line then it could land you a hefty fine. Just don't transmit unless you are properly trained and licensed. This radio has many features and requires the user to read the manual in order to figure out how to properly use it. But when you put in the time, you have capabilities that far exceed the lowly weather radio. The docking station is nice to have and you can always buy more batteries than you think you might need. It is also smaller than anything else on the list.